Hi, I'm Dr. Tu Chao Wei from the Department of Vascular and Interventional Radiology here at the Singapore General Hospital. And today, we're going to talk about gastrostomy tube insertion. Now, the gastrostomy tube is indicated in patients who require long-term assisted tube feeding and that is defined by more than six weeks. This is especially true for patients who struggle on the nasogastric tube, which can be uncomfortable and require frequent changing. Here in interventional radiology, we use direct X-ray visualization in our angio suites to put in the gastrostomy tube without the need for general anesthesia, sedation, or endoscopy. So this is good for patients with airway problems like head and neck cancers and motor neuron disease. The advantages of the gastrostomy tube is that it is more comfortable in everyday life. It is also easily consumed by clothing. It is also more easily changed in the clinic or by the bedside and also it lasts longer than the nasogastric tube. After the gastrostomy tube insertion, we work with a group of specialized nurses who will help to teach the patient and the caregiver on how to look after the tube. As this is a surgical procedure, there are short-term and long-term complications, although severe side effects are uncommon, so you should speak to your doctor about these as well.